Hi guys, it's Anne. Welcome back to my channel. Before we get started, I just want to say I'm sorry for this video being one day late. Uh, I came down with a really bad cold last week and I've been trying to sit down and do this voiceover a couple of times, but my voice has not held up at all. Um, so I decided to just wait until I feel a little bit better and I feel better today, so I'm doing it today. So I'm, I'm sorry about the delay, but better late than never, right? Two days ago was May the 4th and as you all know, that is Star Wars Day and as a <laughs> devoted fan, um, I had to do some sort of fan art, right? And I figured let's just let's throw this little curveball in there, you know? Um, so let's let's just make it a challenge uh, and not just straight up fan art because <laughs> why make it easy on yourself? So I decided to go with the ballpoint pen challenge just because I think it's really... I've been looking at a bunch of these videos and I think it's so fascinating to see all the different textures and, and uh, just effects that you can get with just the one pen. So that's what I decided to do and I started off with... Um, I found this really bright blue um, ballpoint pen so I did all of my initial sketching and just outlining with um, that really bright pen and once I felt like I had kind of the, the basic shapes down I switched over to a more traditional and darker blue ballpoint pen and I did the rest of the piece with that one. Also I'm really impressed that this one pen did not run out of ink <laughs> because there is a lot of background that's colored in and I was swearing to myself and I'm like why did I pick a picture with a dark background and then I, I'm like maybe I should have just left it white in the background but I think that part of this image in particular is the kind of dramatic effect of the really dark background and the um, white suit of the stormtrooper. So I feel like I, you know, I struggled <laughs> for a while, um, but the results in the end are worth it and I think that it would have compromised the uh, kind of integrity of the piece if I decided to do a brighter background. So um, I'm really happy that I stuck to it um, because if I may say so for myself and just pat myself on the back, uh, the results are pretty freaking awesome. So, you know, I've been trying to just expand my repertoire um, and, you know, kind of just focus more on my art. And you're gonna, you're gonna see that on my channel as well. I'm still gonna do my monthly bullet journaling, but other than that, there will be more and more art videos. Um, and I'm really excited about that, so I hope that's something that you guys want as well. Um, if not, let me know in the comments down below and, uh, <laughs> you know. Uh, I had a lot of fun. I had my ups and downs, but in the end it was a lot of fun and I'm really happy with the end result. Uh, if there's any other challenges that you would like me to do on this channel, please let me know in the comments down below and I will do my very best to make that happen for you. So without further ado, thank you so much for watching. Uh, I hope you have an amazing rest of your day. Happy drawing and I'll see you next time. Bye!